Welcome back to this right here. And here is my comic book haul for June 18th, 2015. Let's get started. So actually this first bunch of comics I'm going to show you I purchased on June 14th, 2015. I was going to show you them in a separate video, but I'm like, you know what, let's just save them for Wednesday and make it just one giant video. So let's get started with this first stack. We got Starfire number one, and that's a very nice cover. I love the costume, reminds me of the animated series costume. It's great. I love it. Can't wait to read that. We got the Cap Gwen America and the Mighty Avengers variant cover to the Captain America and the Mighty Avengers comic. This is uh, the Gwen cover, obviously. It looks fantastic. Gwen in all her glory, very popular character right now. We got Mrs. Deadpool and the Helen Commandos number one. A lot of uh, female comics this week. Awesome, awesome cover. I think, yeah, I, I showed you this comic in last week's video, but I picked up another one because it's awesome. We, I picked up Fantastic Four 644. I've had to pick it up because I didn't pick it up when it first came out. And it's like sold out almost everywhere. And I just saw this on the stand at my local comic shop. So I was like, I need to get this. So love it, love it, love it. Uh, I don't believe I picked this up last week. So I picked it up on Sunday. Secret Wars 2099. Awesome. Number two, issue number two. And it comes with... A Spider Gwen variant, Secret Wars, Spider Gwen 2099. Awesome cover, awesome cover. Love all that Gwen stuff. And I picked up a second issue of Ultimate End because I read it and oh my god, it was amazing. I love the 616 characters and meeting the Ultimate characters. It's just awesome. I cannot recommend this book enough. If you are not reading this, you need to read this because it is really good. And we picked up. Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. A number one. I've been meaning to pick this up for a while now. I just never got around to it. And I finally did. And I don't regret it. Issue number one. I got issue number three. Because I didn't have issue number two in stock. But Spider-Man's on the cover. So that's always awesome. I love Spider-Man. And we got issue a number six. And something I was not expecting to pick up. But I saw it in the shelf. And I needed to add it to my collection. Uh, the, the Amazing Spider-Man Renew Your Vows 1 in 25 variant cover. I love it. It's awesome. I had to have it. I don't usually get the 1 in 25 or 1 in 100 variant covers, but I just felt like I needed to get this one because Spider-Man, he's my guy. So this stack that I purchased on Wednesday was purchased at my local comic book shop. But let's get on to the brand new comics of this week, which I purchased at Frankenstein's. And if you don't know what that is, check my last um, comic book haul video and you'll get a nice little tour anyway we have last days of miss marvel which is issue 16 awesome kamala khan fan favorite right now I definitely recommend you pick this book up because this was literally the last one at the guy i go to so i got lucky i picked up Deadpool Secret Secret Wars issue number two. A nice cover. I love the Hulk picking up that giant ass rock. I love it. I love it. And Deadpool's just being Deadpool. Awesome. And it came with a Gwenpool Secret Secret Wars variant cover. Basically, Spider Gwen, I mean Gwen Stacy as Deadpool. Awesome. We got The Last Days of Magneto. That's issue 19 in this current Magneto run. Awesome. And of course, what variant did we get? The Gwen Nito variant. Awesome cover. I really love this one for some reason. It just really stands out to me. I love it. And then we also picked up Armor Wars number two. And I still haven't read the first one, but I had to pick up the second one, you know, so I'm, I don't fall behind. And for those of you who don't know, <laughs> usually if you don't pick up a comic uh, on the first day of its release and it sells out, uh, when you find it again, it probably won't be cover price, or it probably won't be a first print, so just make sure you get your stuff, uh, when it comes out, if you can, because then you're gonna be overpaying, or then you get second prints, and it's just better if you just get it on day release, if you can, but if you can't, then don't worry about it that much. We got Old Man Logan number two, and at first I thought this was a variant, I don't know why, just it has that variant feel to me. But this is actually the cover. Yeah, okay, I just double checked that I didn't want to sound dumb. Yeah, this is the actual cover. And uh, it just it looks like a variant to me. It's not a bad cover. I'm not 
uh, saying it's horrible. I'm just saying it just looks like a variant to me. It's basically what I'm saying. I'm just going to put this down now. And we got the Old Man Logan Gwenverine variant cover. Oh, that needs to be its own series because that is just badass. We got Squadron a Sinister a Number One. Don't know what this is about exactly, but I'm going to find out. We got Thor. Oh, Thor's. I'm sorry. Thor's Number One. Awesome, awesome. Great cover. A little bannering bang. Uh, that looks like Ultimate Thor. And we got 616 Thor, I believe. I don't know the Thors. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not a big Thor guy, but maybe this will get me into him more. We got the Justice League of America number one. Love it. Love this cover. Feels very old school to me. And by old school, I mean like 2008. Uh, around that time period. Great, great cover. But that price, I don't... I don't know about that price. Don't know if you guys can see it. My phone has a pretty messed up camera. But yeah, there we go. Five ninety nine. Probably shouldn't have bought it, but I did. And this is it, guys. The gem of this comic book haul that I wasn't even expecting to pick up. Drum roll, please. This is just amazing. And I got it for pretty cheap, considering. Star Wars number one, the Boba Fett variant. And if you don't know what this is referencing, you need to go look up first appearance of Punisher. Because this cover, if you know what this is referencing, then you can appreciate this awesome, awesome comic. This awesome, awesome cover. Love it. This is great. Definitely the best pickup of the day. And that was this week's comic book haul. It was a little bit of a longer video because I had two stacks to show off. But that's fine. That's fine. We got two great comics. And the Star Wars one and the Spider-Man one. I really liked. Those are my favorite of the stack. What are your favorites? Leave a comment. I want to know what you guys think. Uh, if you like this video, subscribe for more nerdy goodness. And until next time, peace.